A big challenge. I mean, I, I, I um, after I'd finished um, trick and treating with the kids, um, I watched uh, I watched that game, um, and um, Norwich are obviously a strong side, but I still I still saw some positives in what he was trying to do. So I think it'd be a tough game. I really do. Bit of a four-one-four-one they were playing. Whether they change at home, um, I, I, I'm not certain. We'll find out. There may be a, a, a change or two. Oh, because two games come in quickly again, so we might have to look at that. But don't don't expect wholesale changes. No, no, we need that. Con look, I think we've needed that continuity. I'm trying to give us that continuity, and I don't want to really do a U-turn on that now. My, my philosophy will be to go and go and win those games, and that's the thing. And I think when you're doing that, you can you can sometimes end up on on the losing side. But I think from where we were, kind of like 17th or wh wherever we were in the league, I just felt we need to go and win games with two strikers and go forward at teams, even if that means we lose a few games on the way. But clearly, you know, we, we have to have that mentality and 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 stick to the game plan. What upset me at um, Millwall is for 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes after they scored. I lost them a little bit before we came again and we need a reaction immediately, whatever the score is, because away from home, you, you're going to concede goals. That's my point. So you have to react to that situation and we need to react to that really well.